Hello, welcome to Maths with J. So the graph that we've already got here is y equals x squared plus 3x minus 2. And we can see that's the left hand side of the equation that we're trying to solve. So all we need to do is a graph for the right hand side of the equation. So in other words, we need to do a graph of y equals x plus 2 and then find where that meets the parabola and we'll have our solutions. So what you could do is a table of values because we can see that the two axes have not got the same scale so it's probably easier just to plot a few points. So um, often easier to start with um, positive values. So let's put in x is 2 and we will It'll be quite useful to know where it crosses the axis so let's have x is 0 and then we'll have x is minus 2 as well because we know this is going to be a straight line so we only need two points for a straight line but one is a check so all we're doing is adding 2 to each of those values so when x is 2 y is 4 when it's 0 y is 2 and when x is minus 2 then y is equal to 0 so that gives us three points to plot so let's plot them and join them and draw a straight line. So there's the line y equals x plus 2. So now all we need to do is have a look at where that line is cutting the parabola y equals x squared plus 3x minus 2. So as we'd expect we've got uh, two solutions and the left hand one it looks as if x is, what would you say, minus 3.2. And the right hand one, x is about 1.2. So as in the first part of this question, the answers are not exact answers. These are just the best we can do. These are approximations from looking at the graphs.